If you're on foot, welcome to our pedestrian bridges at Clock Tower, former ShopRite and Jewelry Road Junctions. Only cross the widened roads at specified crossing points and strictly obey traffic guidelines. Brought to you by Uganda's newest infrastructure development, the Kampala Flyover Project. Widened roads, enlarged junctions, broadened walkways, the new Sambia underpass with four lanes, the first of its kind in the city. The restored clock tower with a loud gong at the top of every hour. Say goodbye to flooding at clock tower, Zambia Road and Mukwano Road. Better ambience, less pollution and no more time to waste. A stronger national and regional economy boosted by the new Kampala Flyover Project. Implemented by Ghana National Roads Authority and funded by the governments of Uganda and Japan. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's me Jabwell again. So um, it just rained this afternoon in Kampala, Uganda. So guys, I want to go and show you how our road, I mean the new road, the Kampala flyover project looks like when it rains. We all know that that place was too bad. Like, I mean, when it rains, there was a lot of water. This is how Lock Tower used to look like three years before the construction of the new flyover project when there was a very, very heavy rain. Seeing. But right now, the better drainage system that these guys have made, so the water is now passing underground. You can see. Now we are no longer worried of uh, moving or our the vehicles being in water when it rains. Now things are better. I just want to go and show you how it looks like when it rains. Come, let's go.
So guys, all all this water that you are seeing passing here, that same water used to flood this same road. Only cross the wide 